Thank you guys for tuning in to another episode of TTG For Real Film Room. Today's feature is cornerback Ladarius Gunner. Me and Gunner played college ball together at Fort Scott Community College before we both went off to our respective Division I programs. He's very smart, can play safety, corner, nickel. Doesn't have the top end speed, but he's very instinctive. Struggled against Dez Bryant and Julio Jones. But other than that, he had a pretty solid season. Let's check the film out. Let's see what his line of scrimmage footwork looks like. Good job of being patient, getting his hands on him. It's only one way that the receiver can go. The wide receiver ran the stick route, gunner funneled him. Just caught the pick, man. Made a play on Jimmy G. Gunner Bam is in the nickel. Let's check him out. He's in the zone. Does a good job of rerouting the wide receiver. He has his eyes on Murray. Murray throws it. Interception. Gunner goes up for the ball. High pointed, as you can see right here. He had to uh, stretch up and get that one. I almost dropped it, but he caught it. Special team is the reason why Gunner originally made the 53-man roster because of things like this. He just bull rushed the blocker into the tackle, and he get up. You got to celebrate that. Two-man under Gunner is inside leverage. He has help over the top. He does a good job of funneling him, getting his hands on the receiver. He ends up letting the receiver get inside of him, but he has the makeup speed to make the play on the ball. There is in the disguise zone. The wide receiver takes an inside release, so it's just a crack replace. Oh, he just come up and make the play that. It's one thing that he can do. He tackles. Man to man versus Marvin Jones. Gunner gets his hand, both hands on Marvin Jones. Reroutes him because he takes an outside release immediately, as you'll see in this next one. There we go. Circle him up. Uh, both hands. He's taking the angle to cut him off. He looks back for the ball. He just couldn't quite bring the ball in. Ball skills aren't his biggest attribute, but I'm almost positive he'll get better with repetition. Gunner is in a cop technique against Bryce Butler. He does a good job of 1-2, redirecting him. And now the ball is thrown down. Let's make a tackle. <clears throat> Go straight for the kneecaps. Gunner is in a wick technique while inside carry. He's squatting, so you know he has every route that's inside. Does a good job of breaking on the ball and fighting through the defender. Here's the back angle so you guys can see. Good job. Gunner eyes is keen 2-1 through the quarterback. He's sitting on all short routes. As you can see, mm, he broke on it perfectly. He just got to catch it. That's supposed to be top 10. Sports center right there. Gunner initially lunges at the line of scrimmage and misses Julio Jones, but his instinct kicks in, so he cheats the route. Good pass breakup. Gunner is patient at the line of scrimmage, even though it's not a real route. But he also has the awareness to look back and come up and make the tackle on Turbin. On the island against Sharp, let's see what he do. Sharp takes an inside release, jab, outside release. Let's see. Ugh, good pass breakup. Good way to be patient and not panic. Let's check it out from the back angle. What y'all think? Gunner switches it up and uses an inch technique against Garcon, which is hard for long corners, but he still does a good job. Good way to fight through the ball, man. Let's take the back angle out. Gunner must have been in the film room this week. He automatically opens up the gate as if he knows the ball is coming short and towards him. Good job of trusting your instincts and making a play. The Packers are in the soft cover too. Gunner has no immediate threat, so he has to sink, 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 sink until the ball brings him down, which in this case it does. Hmm. He put his helmet right on the pigtail of the football. Let's see if this offensive lineman wants that work. Hmm. He don't want it either. Best player of the year. Man to man versus D-Hop at the top. Let's see, what he's, is he patient? Okay, he's patient. Does a good job of cutting him off and fights through the ball for the back shoulder stop. Here's the back view angle so you guys can see. No, sir. Good job, man. Cannot play that any better. Gunner is in a disguise cover one. The Texans run the motion, man, just to see what the Packers are in. They can't really tell. Good disguise by Ha Ha Clint Dix, but better finish by Gunner right here. That's the easiest pass breakup coming from the outside in instead of the inside out. Here we go. Outside in, like I just said. Versus Curse at the top, Gunner does a good job of funneling him to the sideline and leaving Russell Wilson little to no room for the ball to be thrown. Could have got his head back quicker, but interception, either way it go. Gunner is reading his run pass key, the outside receiver down block, so he has to replace. Does a good job coming up for the tackle. Gunner switches it up with a backpedal inch. He's inching backpedaling, does a good job of breaking off his back foot and continue to fight for the ball. Jake Ryan said, dab me up. <laughs> and he does a pro hop to give him some space to see what the wide receiver is doing does a good job of getting his hands on him and knocking the ball away and mean mug the wide receiver at that inverted cover one des bryant wanted to take an inside release but he couldn't gunner does a good job of just being right there on his hip i almost got hurt though here's the back angle for it 
so you guys can see it a little bit better. Ooh, that's dangerous. Gunner and Randall are in a combo coverage. They're keying one and three. So it's a switch, switch, switch. He has the nearest threat that comes to him first. He has to pick that off. That was a game changing moment right there. But here's the back angle. Gotta have that one right there. That was a must right there. Attention, he is a solid run stuffer. Check this out. Does a good job of run fitting and just making a play on Freeman. Here's the back angle so you guys can see it a little bit better. Hole open up. Hmm. Sticks his head right there. Gunner is in the nickel. He's very versatile, as I said earlier. He's playing a shuffle, shuffle, man to man technique. He does a good job of putting his shoulder right on the ball of Trey Burt, as you'll see in the replay. This was a big play that recently just happened in Tuesday's preseason game. <clears throat> Put his shoulder right on the ball. Good job of just being aggressive. Gunner here is again in the nickel. He didn't make the play, but he jammed him and disrupted the timing of the ball, which led to an interception. This is what coaches love to see when they cut on the tape. Thank you guys for watching Ladarius Gunner episode. Also, follow me on all of my social media platforms, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and SoundCloud. Definitely more quality content to come. Thank you guys, and also subscribe. Peace.